everybody. So I figured I'd do something a little bit different um, this video. I know I said I was gonna do that off haul and I'm still gonna do it. It's literally still in the box upstairs in my bedroom. So hopefully I can get that filmed um, sometime before the weekend's over, but let's do an unboxing. So I have been living reckless with my bag and <laughs> it's been, it's, it's getting out of control. So let me show you. I've had this bag for a while. Ugh but I have stuffed everything that I possibly can, can stuff in here um, for work and it's just not working anymore. So as you can see, I can't even close the top of this anymore with this bag being here and I need this bag, I need all the other things that are in here. So instead of using this uh, coach tote, this is the coach Molly tote, the big one, not the Molly 25 tote. Um, got this from the coach outlet down here. At, it's, it was in Tanger Outlets um, in Washington, PA. But picked this up probably about a little over a year ago and I've been using it pretty much on and off over the last year. But as of lately, I've been using it a lot more often because it's like one of my bigger uh, coach totes, but it's just not big enough anymore. So um, all the things that I usually pack for work every day, I'm staying here and I just don't want it to start really uh, getting beat up. I can see already on this side, like a little bit of the stitching has already come undone and I don't want that to get any worse than it already is. So I decided to go and purchase a new tote. It's actually not even a tote. I'm gonna be honest with y'all, it's a diaper bag. <laughs> but anybody gonna know unless I tell them. So um, it came in this humongous box. As you can see, this box is huge. Um, sometimes I think they just put things in oversized boxes for no reason. But, came nicely packaged with all this bubble wrap. And, this thing is big. Like, there's no reason for me to run out of room. Um, this is a huge diaper bag. So, this is this size. It may be hard to tell on camera how actually big this is, but let's get it out of the bag. Um, so, it looks like, Let's just take it out and I'll show you the tag that they have in here. I didn't pay anywhere near this price for this bag. So, let's take it out. So, it comes in this nice clear plastic coach bag. And then, not be being on the struggle bus. And it comes in kind of like this thin styrofoam wrap around the bag itself. Let's take that off. No, no, I guess that's just stuffing that just fell. And here's the bag itself. So it has the gold accents on it. And then I'll show you all the pockets and stuff. So I don't know if you can see that. Let me see if I get that closer to the camera. Can you see that? Um, you'll see that. But anyway. It might be backwards anyway. Anyway, it says um, $450. Nah, we're not paying that much, so. Um, let me see if my slip, my packing slip is in here. Cause I can't remember what I paid. Oh. All right, so I know I had a coupon. So this is originally 450. Looks like I paid 205. I'm not sure if you can see that. Oh, this light is terrible. Sorry, y'all. Yeah, so 205. If that's not, if that doesn't look backwards, but that's how much. Um, oh, I just put my whole address up there. I might have to wipe that out. But anyway, <laughs> 205 for this big old bag. So, and I am rough on stuff. I'm not gonna lie. I'm not very careful with things. I think that's why that other tote has some um, stitching coming undone on it because I am just rough on things. So um, I will definitely get my money's worth out of this for $205 for this big bag. So, But everything comes wrapped. Now this was also from the Coach Outlet, but this is from the Coach Outlet online. So um, $450 is on the tag. Pay $205 for it. Um, and I think I had a $20 off coupon so it might have been $225 one line plus another $20 off and shipping was free so so they come with all the um, gold pieces wrapped in 
this like thin styrofoam so you have to go through the bag and take everything off but that's fine because it's it just acts as you know protection over the metal parts so we'll take this these off here let's open it up so you have one zipper right here of course it's got the protection on it so let's open this here all this stuff in Put that out oh okay so this is truly a diaper bag because look what comes it has like the little um you know the pad that you put down like if you had a baby you could change the baby on the pad right there so there's that won't be using that so i'll just take that part off and then it was kind of like zip tied on it oh wow there's like a bunch of different pieces in here so still pulling out more cushion stuffing and then it comes with which I, I knew this came with this, but I almost forgot until I opened it. I mean, just opened this up. And I'm pretty excited about this because I can wear this like almost as a messenger bag. It comes with this thick strap like this. And I guess it's daisy chained to, to an inner part. I don't know what, I don't know what this is for, but it's, it's just like an extra strap piece. That's not the whole like crossbody strap. Anyway, let's get the rest of this stuff in out of here. These little silicone pads for freshness. So yeah, on the inside you have these two. If anybody knows what these are for, can you leave me a comment down below? Cause it's literally sewn on the inside of the bag, but then you have these two Maybe they, I don't know. I don't know what they're for. But um, anyways, let's see if I can show you the inside of the bag. So really, really big and spacious. Has all these different little pockets and compartments in here. Um, I can stick my uh, water bottle in. Of course it has the inside pocket in there. This is just, they always come with these little authentic authenticity <laughs> little slips so you prove that's actually a, a coach product I usually hang on to these because sometimes um, I resell things on Macari so um, I just leave these in the bag just in case I don't end up keeping the product and if I resell it for you know of course a reduced price at least the person knows they're getting something that's authentic so but that really ha happens because I like my coach products so but yeah, this is a really nice bag. I'll, get, I'll eventually get all the tags and things off of it. It comes with another little coach description um, tag on here. But yeah, really cute bag. So I'm gonna transfer everything from that Molly tote into here and I should have no problems carrying all my things around. Also, on the outside are these big, massive pockets too as you can see on both sides of the bag so left and right side have these big pockets to put things in so i'm really really happy with this um purchase so i'll get everything packed up um so i'm ready for work on monday and also comes with the coach tags as per usual usually every bag will come with one of these normally it's um color matched to the bag itself so it's, uh, I think this is vinyl. Um, I don't know if it says on the description. Oh yeah, it's recycled uh, nylon, not vinyl, nylon. So it says this accessory contains recycled nylon. It reflects our commitment to rethinking and reducing our impact on the planet. Wear it, love it, repair it, pass it on. Feels good, doesn't it? So um, yeah, what really feels good is that I didn't pay $450 for this bag because it would have never happened. But um, I'll eventually get these uh, protective pieces off of the, you know, let's just take one off now so you can see what the handle looks like. So the handle is like that um, coach leather handle with the nylon bag and the gold accent. So that's what I plan on uh, using for 
my uh, new work bag. So like I said, the most exciting thing for me is having this big thick strap um, that's adjustable, of course, make it as long as I want to, which is going to be pretty long because I plan on using it as like a crossbody bag. Um, it's just easier for me to get out the car third. I don't want to run in a hospital. So uh, very nice. So I'm going to get everything packed up. Um, what things I normally have in a bag, um, of course, also always um, hand sanitizer. This is the spray can from Bath and Body Works. Um, it used to be the kind you could uh, hang on the bag, but the little attachment piece broke, so it won't hang on the bag. So I'll just throw it in the bag now. Um, I also have the little pocket back hand sanitizer. And so this really cute little holder, which holds the small pocket backs, I'll strap on to the thick strap. It'll, it'll strap on just like that, okay? And then I also usually pack in my bag my AirPods. This is a Coach <laughs> AirPod case that I got from Amazon. It was like 10, 13 bucks or something like that. Really, really cute because my phone case is the same as this um, signature Coach design. I will also, these are so cute. This came on another Coach bag that I had. It was a crossbody. I think it was the Hudson Pat bag. And it came with this cute little, um, they didn't come with this. I'm lying, y'all. I'm sorry. I purchased this separate. This was one of the coach accessories that was online. And it's the uh, lock and then also the key. Now, these technically, this key goes into this lock, but I keep them separate because I don't want to lose them. So I just keep them on the, the ring instead of having that key sticking down because as soon as it's going to fall out because this is the release for it and as soon as i hit this button the key's going to fall out so i just keep them separate also i think i got this off of shein it's a cute little um bear little rhinestone bear i think it was like a dollar or something off of shein also this cute little high heel shoe it's rhinestone uh shoe that i'll put on there and I think that's it. Yeah, and then this is also, this came with the lock and key too. And it just says, it's just like a little um, tag and it just says coach on there. So I'll put this on the outside of the bag. Um, I usually, of course, there's cash in my bag. Um, <laughs> my gen alerts, I live by these. These are literally caffeine pills. I know it's not good for your heart and stuff, but I, I try to take it easy. But a lot of times I don't sleep. So this gets me through my bed. Um, also, Coban, for you nurses or people who work in healthcare, you know what this is. This is, um, I, I buy my own Coban because most companies don't want to purchase it. So, I'll buy like a 24 pack off of Amazon for like 15 bucks. And I just keep these in my bag so that when I take my patient's IVs out, it just makes life easier. People who are on blood thinners, I don't have to worry about you bleeding all over the place. I put a gauze down, wrap, and I'm done. So um, I keep a couple rolls of this in my bag. Of course, always um, some type of hand cream because I'm Ashley Larry's wife. And um, I usually carry like one of these um, little mini perfume perfumes in my in my scrub pocket. And it's just easier just to have on you if you want to freshen up throughout the day and when it's right in your pocket. And these are so slender um, and my scrub pockets are pretty wide. So it just slides right down in there. Half the time I don't even know it's in my pocket. So of course a lip gloss, even though I have to wear a mask all day, I still will put a little bit of something on just to keep my lips moisturized. Um, pens are always in my bag. This is another reason why I needed a bigger bag is my planner. Um, it has all like all my notes, all my passwords and stuff to get into the, um, the computer systems and stuff at work. Um, dates that I need for, you know, kids when they don't have school or when they have a concert coming up or I just keep a lot of these things um, written down in my planner. So I carry this with me. Also, just my regular notebook for work. This has all my um, notes for processing images. Um, since I am a newbie, I had to take a lot of notes on just getting um, the computer started up, how to do QC and stuff. So I still carry this around with me because I'm everything's not up here quite yet. Um, I just started working by myself this week. 
Um, this was my first week working by myself because my coworker, she's on maternity leave. So I need this book. Um, and you saw this bag in another haul. This is that pink velour bag from Bath and Body Works. So that's what I was carrying around in the um, the gray Molly tote. So now I'm gonna swap it out because I told y'all I bought this because I wanted to um, use my bright pink one now. It's almost spring, so I'm gonna swap it out. Um, so I'll take everything that's in here and put it in here. And there's mostly just like um, mind grade medication in here. There's like a little first aid kit. Um, hand sanitizer I like the white and um, just other stuff like that you know feminine products and stuff like that so what else is in my bag um, of course my wallet I'll swap out this is the Lord have mercy this is the wallet that um, matches the bag and um, I have another coach um, it's like a bigger wallet that I'll swap out to put in the black bag and it's black and has the black I mean the gold accents on it so I'll use um, swap that out of course you need some Kleenex so this is just my big holder of pens uh, we write a lot in nuclear oh well, I should say in nuclear medicine but we write a lot at my job I have to keep times for when I inject patients, when I scan patients. So I'm constantly writing. Sometimes I'll color code things. So like having these like different colored, um, uh, these are like flare pens, um, just make the job easier. And then also I use a lot of post-its um, for leaving like doctor's notes. Sometimes I have to leave a note for the nurse. So this is just my little holder for stuff like that and just more extra pens on the bottom. They're just regular black Sharpie gel pens. And then I think that's pretty much it. Oh, I got my readers. <laughs> my readers are in here because, ma'am, I'm getting old. So I keep my readers on me. And if I need a little bit of help, um, then I have these. These are just from like, I think, Rite Aid or something. They're just like the plus 125 readers. So real light script, but they come in handy. Oh, also I keep my... Um, so this is a, um, for uh, CPR. So just in case I have my own mouthpiece. Um, these are, of course, not reusable ones. If I ever have to use them on a patient, uh, I would just get a new, a new um, set. So charger. And then of course a brick to go with that. And I think that's pretty much it. The rest of this is just junk. Oh, oh I got a little, um, all-in-one type of it just opens cans and has like a little uh, blade on it and uh, this is for I'm guessing opening wine bottles I don't know why I wouldn't be drinking on the job so and I think it used to have a lighter that worked but it there's there's no more um, butane in here so but I just keep it I throw it in there and keep it with me and that's literally oh of course, I have tape in here, medical tape, but I don't use this much anymore because of the Coban. It just, it's its really not necessary when you have that Coban because the Coban sticks to itself. And I think that's pretty much it. Yeah, that's it. I have uh, cough drops in here from when I wasn't feeling that great. But um, I'll just keep these in the back. You just never know. Um, working around patients and you get a little uh, bug or something, then, you know, you'll need to have it around. So... Let me get everything switched over to the new bag and then I'll show you how much neater it was than having this uh, Molly tote and everything stuffed in it. Okay guys, so here is the finished product. Um, so much better. I actually uh, was able to get that zipped as you can see. So I did put on all the little, I call it bag flare. <laughs> all my little, pretty little, um, keychains and everything on there um, I did actually put the hand or uh, the pocket back holder on the strap so I'll have that let's put that back together uh, now I can't get that stuff back down and I still need to find out what's going on with these little extra straps here but um, I'll show you the inside so it fit everything in there and it has way 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 more more room than the other bag did. And this is the wallet I was telling you about. I think it's like the large wristlet 
wallet. So um, I'll use that for this bag because it matches. So, and then in the interior bag, I just put all the coban and tape medical tape or gosh I am in a struggle bus using this with one hand should just left it open so in there big enough for all my chargers and coban um, that little all-in-one tool so really really nice bag um, if you work in nursing and I know nurses carry a lot of stuff around with them too this would be a perfect bag for you. So um, I think they're still about 225. I think if you sign up for um, Coach Insider and you sign up for their text alert, you'll get an extra $20, um, $20 off. So, but really, really nice bag, guys. So, but that's gonna be it for this video. Next one, I promise, I promise, I promise, it'll be an elf haul. I'll try to get that done either tomorrow or Tuesday. All right, guys, thanks for dropping in. Love you, see you later, bye.